Hi, it's LT Carlson here, and one of my favorite films of 2023 has finally hit the 4K format. The movie I'm talking about today is Megan, one of the latest uh, horror films from Universal Pictures. This movie came out back in January, and it got a Blu-ray release, but it isn't until now that we finally got the 4K. I'm going to be looking at the Best Buy exclusive Steelbook version of the film today. I'll unbox this and share my opinions on the movie. This is one of the most creative steelbooks of recent years, and I absolutely love the way this looks. It's done in the style of the packaging of the Megan doll from the film. Nice close-up there. There's the top of the backing card. Back of the backing card. The spine text has the title of the film. The back has like a blueprint of the Megan doll. It's even got the little choking hazard things and company logos at the bottom. Inside the package, we have a digital code of the film, and we have two discs. We have a Blu-ray disc of the movie. I assume this is probably identical to the one that was released a few months ago. And then at long last, we have the 4K disc of the film. Again, this is the first time it's been released on 4K. Underneath here, we have the Megan user manual on this side. That's not an actual manual, it's just printed on there like it's in a package. That looks very nice. And then you have like alternate fashion choices for the doll printed on that side. So, very cool steelbook. I like the way they did this one. It's not just a bunch of generic pictures from the movie and like poster art. I'm going to read the description of the film as follows from the backing card. It includes unrated and theatrical versions of the film. From James Wan, the producer of Annabelle, and Blumhouse, the producer of The Black Phone, comes a new face in terror. Megan is a marvel of artificial intelligence, a lifelike doll that's programmed to be a child's greatest companion and a parent's greatest ally. Designed by Gemma, a brilliant roboticist, Megan can listen, watch, and learn as it plays the role of friend, teacher, playmate, and protector. When Gemma becomes the unexpected caretaker of her eight-year-old niece, she decides to pair the girl with a Megan prototype, a decision that leads to unimaginable consequences. Now, when I first heard about this movie, my hopes honestly were not that high. It pretty much just sort of looked like a gender swap take on child's play. But I ended up being very pleasantly surprised with Megan, and I don't know if you quite call this one a horror film or a technological thriller, but it's easily one of my favorites of recent years, and again, pleasantly surprised me. The movie, of course, revolves around the creation of the Megan doll, something powered by AI that can become a protector and an educator to children, serving as a toy but also a learning tool of sorts. We've seen plenty of films in Hollywood about how technology meant for the good of mankind could run amok and begin causing disastrous consequences. And Megan just beautifully brings this into the 21st century. I mean, the movie even starts out with some mock toy commercials from the fictional company that's in the movie, showing how ridiculous and consumer-driven the world today is. Megan tries to be a bunch of things, and the movie surprisingly succeeds at most of them. I mean... It's a satire of sorts. It's also a harsh criticism of commercialism and the way kids become addicted to their toys. It's a criticism on the over-reliance that parents have on tablets and toys to try to educate and occupy their children. And of course, sort of a warning as to why you shouldn't use these things in place of traditional parenting and time together. The movie revolves around a young girl who, of course, is orphaned and sent to live with her aunt, who's a brilliant roboticist, who, unfortunately, is not the best when it comes to parenting. And at first, the bond between Megan and this young girl seems like something that's unbreakable. But, of course, it quickly becomes much more than that, and I don't mean that in the best of ways. Meanwhile, the toy company takes an interest in Megan and wants to have a massive launch, making this the product of the century. You can kind of see where all this is going to come together and, of course, do so in the biggest and most disastrous way imaginable. Megan, again, goes for in many different directions, and the movie succeeds at just about everything it does. Probably the only real complaint I have is that there are times where the movie's a little you know, unnecessarily campy. I do like that there is a little bit of humor in here, much of which comes from the mock toy commercials and the obsession children have with said toys, but there are a few things the doll does that just don't really make sense that I think we're thrown in for a few laughs. Overall, though, I would say the good far outweighs the bad. Megan is easily one of my favorite films of 2023, and it's a fresh take on both horror and technological thrillers. 
Again, Megan did not get a 4K release initially. It just got a Blu-ray. But now Universal has done right by the fans and given this one the 4K release that it deserves. And I have to say, this is an absolutely beautiful looking disc. From the brighter, more colorful scenes, including the inner walls of the toy company, to the darker scenes that are a little more shrouded in shadow, that added HDR and shadow detail really does give this one the edge over its 1080p counterpart. I am very pleased with how Megan looks in the 4K format, and I think fans will be pleased they're getting the best looking version of this film possible. Sadly, the only bonus features we get are the trio of EPK type features we got on the Blu-ray and these don't really amount to a whole lot. I mean, you might want to watch them once, but after that, I doubt you'll ever revisit them again. Would have been nice if we could have gotten, you know, some feature-length commentary tracks and things like that. But overall, I'm in it more for the film than the bonus features. And this is a great film that looks absolutely great in this 4K package. And I mean, with the Halloween season right around the corner, what better time is there to watch this one? What did you think of Megan? Did you think this was one of your favorite films of 2023? Do you think it's one of the best horror movies and technological thrillers of recent years? Comment down below and let me know what you think. Also, remember to subscribe to this channel for more content. I'm always posting new videos. And make sure you give this one a like if you found it helpful. I'm Taylor T. Carlson. I'll see you next time.